this is pretty awesome. The Oregon coast. How's it going everyone? This is Matt when we are here. I hope all of you guys are having a great day and are kicking off a great summer vacation. As I just said, I'm here on the beautiful Oregon coast. Honestly, there's nothing that can, can beat this rugged coastline. I mean, look at this. This is just like, <laughs> it's, it's genuinely, this is God's untouched creation. This is, it's, it's truly remarkable. So yeah, there's just a little bit of the coast, but we're gonna take, my family and I, I mean, we're gonna take a drive further down and try to witness more of the coastline. So that's just a sneak peek. <laughs> Actually, we just drove just a bit up the road. We're gonna come here to the botanical gardens. This is pretty stunning. Look at all these like these species of flowers. Like, look at this. This is you think like a 22 year old guy like me would not be impressed by this. <laughs> you thought wrong. We're looking at a koi pond. It's a little bit muddy, but this is pretty awesome. Dad, what do you think of this? Pretty cool. Little gem. A little gem. <laughs> oh, gem. Okay. You know, this is honestly like, this is perfect material for, you know, doing a vlog for the first time in a couple weeks since Cabo. I mean, wow, this is just like, like, I can't describe it. There's a tadpole right there. And then there's another one right around there. Right there, underneath it. Do you see it first? This is a man-eating plant. Look at the size of it. Just one leaf. Yeah, that's, yeah, it's like, it reminds me of like a Venus flytrap or it's got this thing like, yeah, it can, awesome. yeah, it can kill ya. So this species of flower is called Vulcan. I think that's pretty cool. So now we've driven up the road a little bit from Shore Acres. We're technically still in the vicinity, but we're coming to a place called Simpson Reef. Let's go check it out. So this board kind of gives an idea of basically like what types of species are here. That's pretty beautiful. California sea lion, the harbor seal, northern elephant seal, and the stellar sea lion. After a couple hours of driving, we're here in Dunsmuir, California. So we're still in the northern part of the state. We still got a couple hours drive back to Sacramento, but I wanted to finish the vlog here at this resort. And this is not just any resort. This is a resort full of railroad equipment. Like right here behind me or in front of me was this signal. And some of you guys may know, some of you, my friends don't, but I'm a huge foamer. And that basically means I love trains and I have loved trains my entire life. Ever since I was a child, trains have always played a big part of my life. And to come here to this place, it's pretty cool. You can see right over there, there's some cabooses. Those are actually, I believe, our hotel rooms. Like this is a motel and you can stay there. Yeah, you see there's someone walking right over there, there. That's pretty cool, look at that. There are different companies that own those, that had owned those cabooses at one point. This is a snowplow, like old fashioned type. Basically what this would be, what this is used for was obviously removing snow Look at this thing. This thing is huge. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm getting really excited right now about this because this is like, I find this stuff pretty cool. Like this is, this is railroad history right here. And it's 
pretty much, for the most part, preserved, you know, for people to see. This is a logging locomotive. It's, uh, I believe it's called a Shea locomotive, and Shays are most known for having these giant vertical side rods on them. Basically, these were used for logging. These big boys would haul lots of, lots of cars of, that were full of logs. I mean, look at this thing. This thing's beautiful. And get a little bit of a peek inside the cab. Oh my gosh, look at that. There's the firebox. There's the brake. I don't know where the, uh, the whistle is. But look at that, that is so damn cool. Walking around the rest of the facility, you can actually see that a lot of these cars are actually attached to each other. So what they've done is, so that Southern Pacific car is actually attached to this Wells Fargo mail car. So that's all one building in there. That's, that's pretty cool. And it actually goes all, also further back to that, the caboose back there. So I think that's, that's pretty dope. Look at that, there's a swimming pool right there. <laughs> Pretty funny. Now, this place is pretty impressive. You know, I like I like the setup. You know, it's a creative idea, and you're preserving rolling stock, so I think that's uh, pretty ingenious. Also in view from the railroad park is Castle Drags. As, as old as Yosemite. What was that? They call it Craig's Crags. Crags? Castle Crags. That running water. Right next to the resort. All right, guys, I think that's gonna be today's vlog. You know, I just wanted to get a little bit of my journey back home here to California, even though the journey's not over yet. But uh, starting out in Oregon, seeing the sea lions at Shore Acres, and finally coming here to this, this railroad park, mm, top of the line. Good way to, good way to start my, uh, my time back in California. So I'm, I'm really happy. So I just wanna thank you guys for joining for another one and please stay tuned for more content. I will be doing more stuff this summer because I'll have a little bit more time. So as always, to get more content like this, remember to tune in, same Matt time, same Matt channel. Thank you for watching guys and take care.